Hey guys, I'm Rita and in this episode I will show you how you can set up recurring supplier invoice on Xero. To create a recurring or repeat supplier invoice, we need to go to business section and click on bills to pay. From here, we can add a new recurring invoice by clicking in drop down list and new repeating bill section. Now we need to fill in details as requested or required. Firstly, at the top corner, we can add a support document. For example, if we have contract, since this can be added there and we need to add a frequency. So let's start. This is how often this transaction need to be repeated. So in my case, it will happen every one month, but you can change frequency and you can select either weeks or months. Okay. So next one is bill date. So bill date is on 29th uh, every month and due date is seven days in my case and from drop down list days after the bill date but you can select of the following month days after the end of the bill month or of the current month so select the one which is applicable for your case in my case it will be days after the bill date an end date that means when this actually repeat bill or recurring invoice should stop so in my case it will stop on 31st december okay i can save as a draft or approve so in my case i will say save as a draft i want to review it and then approve if required bill from even type in new uh, new supplier so in this case it will be rates limited in my case and because this is not on my contact list i can click new contact and it is adding details there reference i can add reference number business rates okay and then i can add an item so if it's not on my list of items i can add new item so item code will be rates in my case item name is business rates and price is 75 and purchase account search by name so i have rates there no vat and business rates is there and click save this will be automatically filled in there I can add multiple lines or I can delete lines which I don't want actually to be shown. And once I have filled in all these details above, click save. Okay, so recurring invoice has been added there. We can edit it when you click on this actual um, bill and save any changes if you wish. However, if we have already received bill, which we want to convert to recurring invoice, you need to go to that list and find that invoice. So for example, in my case, it's rent bill. And when we go to bill options, we can select repeat. We will need to set up how often this invoice will repeat. So in my case, rent bill will be repeating every month, starting from next month. And due date, I have seven days after the bill date. End date is optional, so this is ongoing, so I will leave blank. Need to select this invoice will be as a, saved as a draft or it will be automatically approved. So in my case, it will be saved as a draft, so I can review and add any attached um, support documents if required at a later time. Bill from reference, it's automatically copied from the invoice as well as description line. I still can amend it if I wish to. For example, if I need to change unit price, I can do it here. So once I have filled in all that information above, I can click save. Now I have rent bill recurring as, as well on this list. So if you go to bills list to access recurring or repeating supplier invoices, you need to go to this tab called repeating and you will be able to review, edit or amend if example price or uh, price have changed or if you need to actually delete, just select and click delete. 
So this is a way how you can add uh, recurring supplier invoices on Xero accounting software. If you have any questions or require any further advice, feel free to reach out to me.